and the biggest cable car in the world has completed four years of operation in Bolivia and has now turned into a self-financing public company. Four years ago, La Paz got its aerial cable car urban transit system. The red line was the first step, and the public transport project now has six lines and 20 stations. The cable car now is quick, safe and clean, so public transport is much better than it used to be. This service is necessary for every Bolivian. You can get to many different places by cable car. Incluso hasta la Plaza Villarreal. It is an alternative solution to mass transport in La Paz, which is a difficult terrain, with more than 300 rivers flowing across the city, making building a subway impossible. After four years, our cable car network has the record of the biggest number of passengers transported in a single day. The yellow line alone moved nearly 85,000 passengers. And after all this time, we can say that this company is one of the few in the world which is totally financially sustainable. It doesn't need any subsidy. During the four years, the first six lines transported 125 million passengers, which is 10 times the country's population. President Evo Morales congratulated the success of this public company. Our company now has been invited to work in different parts of South America. Our company could be giving a service in countries where it never existed before. President Morales also talked about the national and international campaign working against the image of his administration and to damage the country's economic model. In spite of the economic and social results we have achieved, there are some people outside, and even inside the country, that keep attacking our government. They just want our economic model to fail. We need to invest more, and they are opposed to more investment. The cable card network covers more than 20 miles and is in the Guinness Book of World Records as the longest line in the world, with the completion of five more lines, bringing its number to 11 by 2020. More than $700 million will be invested and the service will cover more than 30 miles. Telesur, Bolivia.